The opportunities that students get by getting a fellowship from, from Google are really pretty significant. Not only do we provide three years of funding, but we also provide a Google sponsor. So someone who, along with their academic mentor, is actually helping them in their, in their research pursuits. So we really give them a lot of insight into the industry view while they're working on their academic experiences. Receiving the PhD fellowship really gave me a lot of freedom to pursue my own research directions and my own projects. As a PhD fellowship recipient, you're free to do whatever you want, and you can drop a lot of the smaller things that you're working on and work on something really ambitious. This program gives us the chance to tap into some of the budding talent and get to know researchers and research programs throughout the world who might be thinking about things from different perspectives uh, than we have. I decided to become a mentor because I always found interacting with students to be um, very vibrant and they bring a useful energy to new ideas and new innovation methods that we may not have necessarily considered here at Google. What I often tell young researchers and people earlier in the career is the, the best way to learn things is to work with people who know things that you don't. Collaboratively, you can then solve problems that none of you could do individually. Think about how these cutting edge technologies that are so present right now, things like machine learning and deep learning, even quantum as it's starting to emerge, is to think about how these are actually going to impact society and the people who use them. We're trying to tackle some really hard research problems here at Google, and so having that two-way communication between Google and Google Research and the rest of the research community is just really great and really important. We want to make sure that we are together preparing this next generation for all kinds of exciting and innovative things.